Hey everyone, Michelle Edhouse here and today I'm going to play with an idea that I've been having for a while. There's a beautiful vista that I get to see every time I drive into Rotorua from our home and it's a sky, lake, hill, foreground kind of deal and so I have been playing with the idea of swipes and paws and stuff and I'm just going to have a play on this tiny little canvas. These are four for four dollars from the warehouse. Um, they're <coughs> um, sorry about the road noise. Um, they are 15 centimeters by 15 centimeters so in inches that's six by six um so i'm gonna do two different colors i'm actually uh no what i'm actually gonna do is i'm going to do a i'm gonna do this lake and sky first and I'm going to do this a little bit different to how I normally do things, um, just because I'm being different. Um, I have got my light blue, uh, that's a bit too thick. Um, tell you what, having a little squeegee bottle with a tinsy wincy little hole in it with your water in makes it really easy to just add a small amount of water okay so what I'm going to do <laughs> is I've got hmm. so what I'm going to have it at the end hopefully is sky with some white clouds lake with some listening silvery reflection in it and then the Mount Nungataha and then a bit of foreground so <clears throat> how do I see this working how I see it working is I don't really know ah help no. <laughs> uh, do, 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 do. So I'm going to put, I don't have any silicon in my white and I just want a tiny little, little bit of white through that and hello, yay my friend's going to come and watch me pour this one. So I'm just going to do a bit of sky at the top and um, just kind of smear that around a bit and maybe even pour a bit over that to get Oops, didn't leave a lot in the cup for that but that's okay um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to, because the idea of that is that the, the white's the clouds. You like it? Then the next bit, uh, I'm going to do some green, some dark green. That's alright, some light green and I've got a little bit of dark blue left and a little brown, so just a little bit of blue, just because I can, but not much. That's because it's being, it's asking to, it wants to go in there. So then some green, this is the brown I mixed up, no it's not, it's purple. Where did the brown go that I mixed up? There it is, over there. That one's the brown. That's my little chocolate brown. <laughs> White chocolate. 
And then, what else was I going to put in there? Oh, bronze. Because you got to have bronze in your hilltop. <laughs> Can't have brown and not bronze. That's my interesting point of view. So, use the other end of that stick just to give that a bit of a whoosh, a squishy, squishy whoosh. Now, Mount Mangataha kind of goes like that. And then you've got background in the back. How's that? I don't have enough sky, do I? Let's just tip all of that up. Just over a bit. It's not as green as I thought it was going to be. Oh, well. that's why I'm doing it on a small canvas, people. I always make that into the tower on the top of the hill. <laughs> Let's see if we can get any more paint out of this one to bring that down. Clean fingers. <laughs> Um, I'm just gonna, those clouds are gonna go sort of swooshy. I think I like swooshy clouds. The swooshy blue to come down this side too. Alright, so we've got a hill, we've got some sky. Now I'm just going to add a whole heap of green because the foreground's always greener. Always greener on the other side. Some green. Just because I can, you know, this is clay. Clay, clay. <laughs> I feel like a little kid when I'm playing with this stuff because it's so much fun and nobody knows exactly what it's supposed to look like so who cares because it's art baby one of the things I found totally freeing compared to the other art I've done in the past which had to be picture perfect if it didn't look exactly like what it was supposed to look like it was bad, terrible, awful and wrong so, now, nobody even has to know that this is supposed to be a landscape. <laughs> Love it. <clears throat> so, we've lost a lot of sky because the hill grew. It's important the hills grow. But preferably not volcanically. <laughs> and seeing as that is a mountain, rather it didn't grow. I don't know about you. What about you? Do you reckon? Would you yeah. rather it didn't grow? No. No, you yeah. would. Yeah. So we're just going to throw a little bit more. And I'm putting silver in this one because, you know, lakes sparkle. Don't they? Mine do. In my dreams, my lake is sparkly. Sparkly and blue. How does my lake look like to you? Oh. Gotta have a horizon line that works too. Hmm. Okay, Sky, if you're gonna come back, you gotta come back all the way and not leave a big stick of brown up there. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. That's the way. Uh huh. Uh huh. I like it. How's that, guys, for a landscape? I didn't put any sticks under this. Can you step those four little cuppies out upside down for me? Preferably not in those big puddles because then we can use runoff. Beautiful. So there you go, guys. There's my first landscape using pouring. How's it get me better than that? Even 
got lumpy bumpy bits as you go up the mountain steps almost to climb the mountain must be I think it must be the middle of summer because the mountains a bit brown <laughs> <laughs> There you go, there's my first attempt at a landscape. Not overly excited about the possibilities, but that's okay. In fact, the water looks more like the sky, and the sky looks more like the water. But hey, little, little, the cat had a fiddle. Oh. I got to have a play with paint. How's it get any better than that? You know what? I can't cope with that brown hill. Doesn't work for me at all. So let's see if we can get some cells. And a popsicle stick that's not um, contaminated with something else would be really good. And then a little bit of a swipe. And a little bit of a swipe that way. There. How does it get any cooler than that? I like picking my other flat top, but I like the flat top on the Taha. It doesn't work for me. Starting to try and be precise again, aren't I, guys? That's not not the idea. Oh well, let's torch it. <laughs> Set it on fire, baby. Let's give it a blow torch. any silicon in the green so oh there's a few little cells down there mm. when you start getting steam you know you've done it too much <laughs> <laughs> how's it get any better than that Great question. That's weird, wacky, wonderful, and probably not saleable, but that's okay. That's cool. I like it. I got it out of my head. I had to try. You know, you get one of those ideas in your head and you just gotta try. You gotta do it, baby, gotta do it. I do like this. This would make some pretty cool macros. And some pretty cool ones down here. Alright guys, let's get you down. But, there you have it. In all its ugly glory. <laughs> Can you tell I don't really like it? I quite like, like the blue, but then I'm a blue freak. On my last painting, I got my macro lens out for my camera. I got some really cool photos, so I might do this with this as well. There are some really cool little cells in the hill and still got brown on it. Maybe I should have just stuck to the, <laughs> the sparkly brown and not the chocolate brown. But there's some pretty cool little macro-y type shots in the sky as well if I can get the light to, to work for you. And I like this one down here. It almost looks like my signature. Not really, but it kind of looks like it's a signature. I get this to. Hmm. There we go. Look at that. That's so pretty. Not a lot going on down in the foreground. But that's okay. How does it get any better than that? You win some, or you lose some. And as I said, there's some pretty cool macros.
all right guys thanks for watching and we'll catch you on the flip side bye bye all right guys so we played with the um the runoff and got some pretty cool little things happening you see that one There we go, I like that one. And I really don't like that one. So, here we go. This is what's called a swipe. And that's how I made that really cool one the other day. So, um, I'm not liking that. Or that. Let's just see what we can create. When the Harley goes past the driveway. We see if it's not too late. And then I found that a straw is a really good leveling bar. Alright, now then we get the torch. <laughs> I tried it, I didn't like it, so we change it. See what magic we can create. That's what we're all about. You do the hokey pokey. You do the hokey pokey. And see if you get anything you likey. Alright, we've gone right down to the canvas and heaps of faces, which is not cool. focus so once again the camera is not giving you a high quality color depiction there you go it's quite a bit of green in this and some really cute, cute little cells coming through I like it just as long as nobody asked me to replicate these colors because <laughs> Just like the other neutral coloured one I did, uh, it's a I hate it, I'm going to swipe it one. So there you go guys, that's what happens when you hate it and you swipe it. You get some pretty cool neutral colours. How's it get any better than that? What else is possible? Have fun. Catch you on the flip side. See you later.